Have you ever wondered how a king's battle with cancer can inspire a princess? The tale unfolds with the king's diagnosis of cancer, a diagnosis that shook the royal family and the world alike. Imagine the castle walls echoing with hushed whispers, the initial shock settling into a grim reality. Yet amidst the uncertainty, the king's strength shone brightly, his determination unwavering. The king, a beacon of perseverance, embarked on his journey towards recovery. Every step he took, every challenge he faced, he did so with an iron will. His strength was not just for himself, but for his kingdom, his family, and for one person in particular, his beloved daughter-in-law, Kate Middleton. In the face of adversity, the king made a decision that would forever change the course of royal protocol. He chose to share his battle with the world, to go public with his diagnosis. This was not just a king fighting a personal battle, this was a king standing tall, showing the world that even royalty wasn't immune to life's trials. His decision to go public was met with an outpouring of support from around the world. The king, usually seen as an epitome of strength and stability, was now also a symbol of vulnerability and resilience. His fight was no longer just his own, it was shared with millions around the world. And while the world rallied around the king, his actions ignited a spark in the heart of the Princess of Wales. Inspired by his bravery, Kate Middleton found the courage to face her own battle. The king's strength became her strength, his resilience her resilience. His battle was not just a fight against cancer, it was also a fight for hope, a fight for life. And as he bravely navigated through these challenging times, he unknowingly set the stage for another battle to unfold. Just as the king began to navigate through these challenging times, so too did our beloved Kate Middleton. Imagine the strength it takes to face cancer, not just once, but twice within the royal family. In a twist of fate, the Princess of Wales, Kate Middleton, found herself diagnosed with the same illness that her father-in-law, the King, was battling. The Princess, always known for her grace and poise, was thrown into a world of uncertainty and fear, a world where the King had already been living for some months. But it was in this world that the King's bravery shone a beacon of hope. His choice to break royal protocol and share his cancer diagnosis with the world was a testament to his courage. This act of bravery did not go unnoticed by the Princess of Wales. Inspired by his strength and the warm response of the public, she too made the decision to reveal her own illness. January brought them both to the same hospital. Kate was there for abdominal surgery, while the King underwent a procedure on his prostate. One can only imagine the heaviness within the walls of that hospital room. Yet in the midst of his own battle, the king found the strength to offer comfort to his daughter-in-law. He toddled from his own bed to visit Kate in her room, a gesture of support that undoubtedly meant the world to her. In the face of adversity, they found strength in each other. These two battles, fought simultaneously yet separately, forged a bond between the king and the Princess of Wales. They shared not just a diagnosis, but a determination, a will to fight, and a hope for the future. As the King slowly recovers and Kate continues her fight, their story serves as a reminder of the power of resilience and unity. Through their shared experience, they have shown the world that, even in the darkest of times, there is always a glimmer of hope, and sometimes that glimmer can be found in the most unlikely of places in the midst of a battle between a king and his daughter-in-law. In the face of adversity, they found strength in each other. What does it take to stand strong in the face of cancer, a loving support system? When the walls of the palace echoed with the news of Kate's diagnosis, it wasn't just the king who stood by her side. Prince William, her husband, and Camilla, the king's wife, rallied around her, creating a fort of love and support. This was the time when the palace truly became a haven, a sanctuary where Kate could draw strength from her loved ones. Prince William, the rock that he is, remained steadfast in his support for Kate. He chose to step away from his public duties, focusing his attention on his wife and their family. His unwavering presence, his strength and his devotion provided Kate with a sense of calm amidst the storm. His actions were a soothing balm, a testament to their enduring love. 
Camilla too offered her unwavering support. Her actions, both publicly and privately, were a beacon of hope and comfort. In the face of adversity, Camilla stood strong, offering her love and support to Kate. This was a time when the bonds of family were tested and they didn't falter. Instead, they strengthened, becoming an impenetrable fortress against the onslaught of the disease. The palace, usually a hub of royal activities, transformed into a sanctuary. It was here that Kate found comfort, solace, and the strength to continue her fight against cancer. The support she received from her family was not just a source of comfort, but also a source of inspiration. It was a reminder that she was not alone in her battle, that she had a team of loved ones rallying around her, lending her their strength. The importance of a strong support system cannot be understated. It is often the backbone that keeps one standing during the hardest of times. And for Kate, her support system was her fortress, her sanctuary, her beacon of hope. With a strong support system, Kate continued her fight against cancer. Good news often brings renewed strength. So it was with the King's recovery. After a period of intensive treatment and recuperation, His Majesty's medical team expressed their satisfaction with the progress he had made. Though the King isn't entirely clear of the disease and continues his treatment, the doctors remained optimistic about his recovery. This news, a beacon of hope, echoed through the palace halls and reached Princess Kate, who was also in the midst of her own cancer battle. The King's resilience in the face of adversity became a source of inspiration for her. As the King returned to his public duties, Kate found renewed determination in her own fight, a testament to the bond they had formed during their shared hospital stays. Buckingham Palace, to mark this momentous occasion, announced two major milestone events. On Tuesday, in a deeply poignant engagement, the King and Queen will visit a cancer treatment center. There they will meet with medical specialists and patients, an experience that will undoubtedly resonate with the King and his beloved daughter-in-law, given their own personal battles. The palace also plans to host an incoming state visit by the Emperor and Empress of Japan in late June, at the request of the government. This re-emergence into public life is a sign of the King's improving health and his determination to continue serving his people. To celebrate the King's return to public duties, a beautiful new portrait of Charles and Camilla was released. Taken the day after their 19th wedding anniversary, the image shows the royal couple looking radiant and at ease, a reflection of the positive turn in their lives. The King's recovery is not just a personal victory. It is a symbol of hope for others fighting similar battles. It is a testament to the power of resilience, the importance of support, and the strength of the human spirit. With the King's recovery, Kate found renewed determination in her own fight. In the midst of his own battle, the King found a way to pay tribute to Kate Middleton. As he began to see the light at the end of his own tunnel, the King turned his attention to those still in the thick of the fight. Among them, his beloved daughter-in-law, Kate Middleton. His tribute to her was not a grand speech, nor a lavishly organized event. Instead, it was a quiet, heartfelt gesture of solidarity and support. The King, together with the Queen, announced plans to visit a cancer treatment center. This visit is not merely a formality, it is a deeply poignant engagement, given the King's own battle with cancer and that of Kate. It symbolizes their resilience, their determination, and above all, their shared understanding of the trials they have faced. At the center, they will meet with medical specialists and patients, offering comfort and hope. They will listen to stories, share their own, and in doing so, forge an even stronger bond with those in the same fight. This visit is a tribute not only to Kate, but to all those battling cancer. In addition, the King and Queen will host an incoming state visit by the Emperor and Empress of Japan. This engagement, requested by the government, is a testament to the King's recovery and his commitment to resume his duties. It represents a return to normalcy, a beacon of hope for those who look up to him, including Kate. These events are more than just royal duties. They are symbols of resilience and determination, a testament to the unyielding spirit of the King and Kate. They are a tribute to their shared battle, a tribute to their courage, and a tribute to their hope. 
The King's tribute to Kate Middleton is not an extravagant display. It is a shared understanding, a shared experience, and a shared determination to continue the fight. It is a message of hope, not only for Kate, but for all those battling cancer. In their battles, they found inspiration in each other and gave hope to many others facing the same fight.